So what are your emotions as you get ready to play your first regular season game? Uh, excitement. Just really excited. This is be a fun year. I mean, there's so many new faces, and uh, you're going to a place that you know has a big history of winning. I mean, how much of a challenge is this opener going to be on the road and the tough building? Uh, I'm not really worried about our opponent. I mean, every night's a challenge in the NBA. Uh, everybody can play. Anybody can win on any, any given night. So you gotta have the respect for the opponent, regardless. Uh, we gotta focus on us and what we uh, need to do as a team. I guess Mitch uh, like rolled his ankle yesterday. Mm -hmm. 50 50 yeah. go. He he can't go. How comfortable are you at the five if you need to be there? Uh, I'm fine. Yeah, I'll be fine. I think Mitch starting that point guard though. I don't know. <laughs> See, no, I'm messing with you. Uh, he'll be fine. Um, he'll be fine when he's ready to go. Uh, he'll be ready to go. Uh, you know, so I don't have no update on nothing, man. If y'all want to answer, I don't have an update on nothing, bro. I, I just saw him today. So. Do you recall your your first regular season game? You know, as a rookie, and what what kind of wisdom can you can you pass on to RJ? As a rookie, my first regular season game, uh, Staples Center. Kobe, it was pretty fun. Uh, you know, just go out there and enjoy yourself. You're not gonna be perfect. Um, you know, but just enjoy yourself, enjoy the process, keep getting better day by day. Anything from your, you put up really nice numbers in the preseason. Anything about the preseason you'd like to have back now? Or was there anything that you know, oh, you everything, like you really... everything was a learning experience. Uh, everything was positive and us taking a step forward uh, as an individual and as a team to get better. Uh, the real thing starts now, so I'm ready to get it going. We, you know, we talked a lot about you being a focal point for this team offensively, specifically. Mm. Did, how much did, uh, or if at all, did the, the stretch with New Orleans when Anthony was out? Uh, how much did that help you kind of get ready for this? It helped me a lot, you know, uh, as far as focusing on you know, how defense is going to play me, uh, loading up, you know, so I got to make my teammates better. So uh, it definitely helped me a lot. Gave me that experience and confidence I needed uh, to go into the summer uh, to work and get ready for this opportunity. And uh, it's here now, so I'm excited. To the work that you've put in, have you seen some of um, the improvement on the defensive end that you put in in, in this offseason? Absolutely, the absolutely, yeah. I mean, it's just attention to detail, focus, you know, watching film, all, that, all those things uh, help you get better defensively. And Fizz is drilling the hell out of us uh, every day. Um, so, you know, that's been more about focus than the offense. Offense is the easiest thing to fix in the NBA, but uh, you know that we have a, a basis, uh, you know, defensive principles that we've had from the uh, first day of training camp. That's very important, and uh, you know, we're getting really good at it. Fizz mentioned uh, he would like to see just in general the group rebound the ball better based on what he saw in preseason. See stuff on film that can be corrected that can help you guys. Yeah, we just watched a 30-minute film session <laughs> of missed rebound opportunities. So uh, I think it's. You know, cemented in our head now. You know, the box up and get the rebound. Is it like a technique, just the simplest boxing out? Yeah, or it's, is a it a technique, it's a technique and a mindset. Rebounding is, is all effort and heart, really, in the NBA. But it's also, you know, technique and mindset. A lot of times we're just standing watching, and the ball's bouncing over our head. So uh, when it's doing that, that becomes a technique thing, but it's also effort.